And now at noon, we begin with a developing story here at home. The search for alleged armed suspect has come to an end. Police believe the man was armed with a knife. The search led to five schools being placed on lockdown. We have live team coverage beginning with CBS 4's Peter Dench. Peter? Elliot, I just spoke on the telephone with Carl Zogby, the executive assistant to the chief of police and police spokesman. He told me that Johnny Chavez was found hiding in a backyard at 5611 nearby West 21st Court. Now, Chavez is an MMA fighter, but Zogby told me he did not put up a fight when taken into custody. Chopper 4 captures MMA fighter Johnny Chavez in handcuffs. He was taken into custody after police set up a perimeter within blocks of the family home. Police say it all started at 8.15 in the morning when they responded to the home for a domestic violence call. They say Chavez got into an argument and took off. We know this house. We've come here before. 30-year-old John Chavez, 6 foot 2, 220 pounds, full of tattoos, history of mental illness, history of violence. We've been here before. This morning he had a crisis. He ran from officers holding a kitchen knife of some sort, ran into this neighborhood area of West 20th Avenue, 5, 6th Street in Hialeah. Five schools were locked down because police felt Chavez was dangerous. He's an irrational man, man who's having a, a, an emotional crisis today, but he's very dangerous at this time. Now, Carl Zogby just told us there were no incidents or problems at any of the schools. He also told us that police are looking for the knife that Chavez had. He said he may have an update later today. But one final note, he noted that uh, uh, Chavez could face a series of charges, including burglary and fleeing and eluding police. We're live in Hialeah, Peter Dench, CBS 4 News.